Welcome to Coffee Break. Here we go again with season two. Free refills. This is fantastic. Hey, you internethers, stay tuned. Hope Farms brought in three alpacas to be castrated. And of course, we got the job done. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there we go. Easy. Up, up. <laughs> the update is, it took a couple of weeks, but the alpacas are doing fine and living the life of Riley. First fact is that alpaca wool is actually softer than sheep wool. It is also hypoallergenic and, surprise, flame resistant. This is getting too hot. We have so many questions, we better hurry up. Janet V, do skunks make good pets after you de-stink them? Uh, probably. A skunk does not like his own stink, believe me. That doesn't work. Robert B, what makes you laugh the most? Watching animals interact. <laughs> when you see two dogs playing, or two cats just running through the house. That's always a lot of fun. Healthy animals. This is a little downtime. Here is coffee break again. I would like to introduce Dr. Brenda and her pet. And this is Cedar, an unusual pet, of course. Sit. <laughs> he doesn't sit, <laughs> he just steps. And he... Cedar weighs 2,490 pounds. That is a big pet. It's amazingly how these animals, this size, can be safe. Right. You do have to work with him. He has a yoke and a harness that he wears. Um, and then he'll, you know, follow voice commands and do whatever I want him to do. Yes. Just don't drool on me. An ox is a steer that's been trained to work. We use it more as a job term than a description of him as a bovine. Right. And I tell you, he can pull a big load. Pound for pound, these animals are stronger than horses. Right. But they aren't as fast as no. horses. Good. Beautiful animals. Yeah. These animals, everybody likes to be scratched a little bit. And yes, they lose more hair than I ever had. <laughs> <laughs> Good night. Sleep tight. 